Hello, Anterly viewers. Today, let's talk about video games. I mean, I know we've talked about video games more than once in the past, but let's take a step back and make sure that everyone knows the differences between various types of video games. Where should you start? From ball and paddle, to shooters, to hack and slash, to RPGs, there are so many types of games out there. And with all the different lingo that people throw around, sometimes it can be kind of hard to figure out what's what. What types of games are for you? Let's find out. A shooter is a game that deals mostly with combat, be it guns or other projectile weapons. These games are divided into two categories, first person and third person. The distinction is made wholly on the camera angle used for the game. A first person shooter, or FPS, is based on a single person, you, doing the fighting. The camera's perspective gives you the limited viewpoint of the main character, and this character is the protagonist of the game. A third person shooter shows the character from a distance, giving the player a wider view of their surroundings. Regardless of the point of view, shooters are almost always action games. They tend to include free roaming within the world, they incorporate different sorts of 3D graphics to make it a more inclusive experience, and most offer multiplayer options. Platform games are also another form of action game, for the most part. They get their name from the fact that players spend their time going from platform to platform by swinging or jumping or bouncing or climbing. These are games like Mario or Donkey Kong or Sonic the Hedgehog. Platform games tend to have a lot of crossover with side-scroller games as well. This is another video game term based on the camera angle used to play the game. Side-scrollers are games that are viewed from a side camera angle and the player generally moves from left to right across the screen. Strategy games are a type of game that don't rely on button mashing or using quick combos to beat an opponent, but instead rely on on problem solving, planning, or honing your skills to claim your victory. Any game with a strategic or logical or tactical focus fall into this category. There are two main subdivisions of strategy games which are real-time and turn-based. These are pretty self-explanatory. In turn-based games, players take turns making moves against each other, and in real-time strategy games, players all make their moves simultaneously. Simulation games or sim games are a genre of game that try to recreate real life or more accurately, fictional life. They're sometimes used for training or as a sort of educational device, but more often than not, sim games are used merely for entertainment. Sim games tend not to have any sort of defined win condition or goal, but instead allow the player to sort of run around in a world as a character and do things. Popular sim games include Farmville, Roller Coaster Tycoon, Animal Crossing, and of course, the Sims. Which types of games are your favorite to play, and which of the bajillion different types of games out there did I leave out that you think people might enjoy? <laughs> Let me know in the comments below, and until next time, it's game over.